Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome back to this let's play of Endless Legend. We're messing about with the one of the newer species. At least to me. Maybe not to you, but to me certainly. We do have some neighbors down here, I don't know who they are. Not that keen on visiting them either. Okay, so we research the mill foundry. Um let's see. Right now there's one that has pacified at least six villagers. Uh, Fomorians encountered. Stranger and stranger. Uh, this fortress complex in the open sea must be a work of the ancient occupants of the planet. Um, yet there are no longer present. The fortress is manned by a strange species of creature. Will you, will you talk or attack? Um, where? What? Um, oops. There. Okay. The fortress is composed of one citadel surrounded by several facilities. Yeah, this is news to me. So what the heck is going on here? Is that a different faction? Is that... What are these things? Boarding vessels. Factions, Fomorians. Are these a major faction? No, they're not. But they're rather close to my town here. I don't know if I... I don't know if I like this. Um, naval unit with boarding party. Again, I have not played this with the latest expansions, and this is news to me. This whole whole thing about uh, entering into the oceans. We'll see how that goes. Uh, first, now we're gonna party with this guy. There we go. They're now pacified. We pacified seven villages. Bit of a risk to pacify the village right on their doorstep. That's gonna give them a hell of an advantage if they settle the area. Um, but that should bring us to the forefront on this quest. Just need to pacify one more village and we're gonna get all that lovely, lovely initiative. Which is something we can do uh, if we're gonna go this way. We're gonna go here anyway. Um, part A. Okay, so you're gonna require me to pacify both villages, and that's a pretty darn big region. Hmm. Now I could be uh, quick about this and just bribe him, regardless. I mean, we pacified most of the villages in this area. Already. Um, so either I can wait and try to gamble that uh, we can finish this. Three turns. Well, at least we can, uh, regardless, we can do this and get uh, influence for gold, and I'm fine with this. Uh, five titanium. That, on the other hand, I'm not so okay with. I'm just going to do this. Yeah, I failed the quest because I did, I did that, but I'm okay with this. That means we completed the legendary deed, which was my goal. So now we get 15% initiative on all units for the rest of the game. Yay! So we're gonna move faster than everybody else, and I think we're gonna complete this quest next turn.
But I'm very uncertain about this guy. <laughs> Roaming party. And they move across the ocean. I assume they're gonna attack the cities. We do have a garrison. And the garrison is stronger than the boarding party thing there anyway. Can I rush by one of these? No, not anymore. I could before. Go to Mill Foundry. It's gonna be fine. Uh, by the time this guy finishes off, I'm gonna have this sky thing nearby so I can scout out ahead of the poor settler. So I'm now uncertain if I can actually attack into... or I can settle the seas. Because this is something new to me. Okay, you are gonna go here and finish that quest. There we go. 15 wine, 15 titanium. I am greatest. And let's just do a normal search. A couple of pearls. And uh, let's head up to this one. Yeah, that one first, then south to this, and then we go and meet our neighbor. And we are going to try to start expanding in his direction, I think. We now have a fair chunk of resources. Too. That's rather nice. Though our city is fairly small. Wait a second, three. Uh, yeah, right, now we can... No, no, actually we can't. We still need to get, like, one more booster. If we finish this mission over there. It's gonna be great. No roaming armies, they asked. Wait, is that... That's theirs. No enemy army. And that's their army, so it shouldn't be an enemy. Wait. Wait! Does their own army count against us? I am not certain. We'll just deal in pearls. Great. Head on this way. Yeah, I do think we want to settle these two regions and just block him a bit. And though this region is kind of crap, but we already pacified the villages. So... Now we shall see when the settler is built. But I'm very curious about this thing. Does that count as an enemy army? Um, I'm gonna make a save. Alai, that's all, that's who we are. I just want to see, does that count as an enemy army for the quest? If it does, we'll have to attack, but reload an attack. No, okay, that's fine. Um, they are pacified and willing to serve you. And now we have 15 spices, which should finish that other thing. Uh, first we have 30 units at end of turn. So yeah, we're gonna wait one turn. We're gonna get that boost, that thing. And then we can fire off all the boosters. Like crazy. And I also wanna see, uh, can we buy the darn mill foundry? We can, and I'm gonna do that. Dramatically increase our production. I think that would be good. You're here. Search the ruin. Uh, okay, so if we build two extractors for luxuries, then we're gonna get the augmented extractor thing. Tech. Uh, is there a time limit on this? No. That's a fairly decent quest to get. I'm okay with this. We need to get luxury resources in order to Take advantage of it, but that's fine. And let's go on this side of the ridge, so we can finish exploring this whole region. 
Oh, there was another. Another ruin over there. I want that. Okay, now we're free to move this guy around. I, this is still an enemy army. <laughs> yeah, the village is pacified, but there, the enemy army there is still very much a thing. Uh, 92, 92. I don't think I want to attack that one without the rest of the army. Yeah, we're going to send him back here and basically help out our... Uh, Our um, settler, because it's going to be produced soon. We have enough influence now to integrate the boss. I am going to hold off on that for a little while longer, though. Yeah, we finished the mill foundry. Next is the settler. Wait, did you it just dawn on me that they might have eaten all the production? At any rate, we got the quest done. You have made an impressive step, uh, but do not rest on your laurels. Other fac factions also dream of your level of wealth. Yeah. Here we have those roaming units back. Perhaps it was a mistake to found on the coast. Uh, there is that thing over there. Yeah, okay, so we, I didn't basically spend all the production I've used on the settlers so far for this, after all. Uh, go there and just pop that one, hopefully. Uh, yeah, yeah, go here. A destroyed village. More glass steel, more pearls. Um... Hopefully this is just their starting region, and hopefully their city is in the southern side, we'll see. They did destroy this one though. So this region actually has three villages. Does it? Kasanji there as well. I mean, the more of these villages you get, the better you're off, so... The Kasanji would be rather cool, but I think... Okay, we're gonna... I think we're gonna go for see that one first. But we are now free to use the boosters. Um, and I think we just might. Let's see, what do we have? We can get extra food. Uh, gold and city upkeep. Uh, that's not that useful just yet. How much do we pay in upkeep? A military upkeep, but I want... This is city, right? That one won't really give us anything. Um... 30% fortification bonus. Mm, yeah. That one, though, is really nice. As is that. Dramatic increase in production. Uh, let's try this one first. I want to see. Minus 50% gold on city upkeep. Okay, fair enough. Uh, Emperor, the, the, the Empire got happy. Sure, let's grow more food. They're now super happy. That's just base happiness. I want to try to reserve these a little bit. Isn't there a age bonus for spending resources as well? Attack and defeat 10 armies, okay. Trade routes. And that's just a legendary building. Okay, that's not something we're going to do right off the bat. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I'm just trying to decide if I want to kick in the Titan Bones. Uh, 
and get a ton of production. Um, get rid of the seeker there. We have the resources to build that museum, but uh, that's gonna take quite a while. And our quest is to build that altar thing. I think I want to build the altar first. It will count as a district. So, as you can see, by building a district we're gonna expand our yield for these other squares. And I think we're gonna go this way, so we can get towards the uh, things that add uh, influence or uh, happiness. So, we're gonna build one there. The altar. Heck with it, let's start with the titan bones. Um, yeah, let's just fire him off and see what happens. So right now our city is going to be quite happy. Uh, I think we're also going to integrate the boss. There we go, so now we're going to get 5% extra food per village. Which right now isn't that much. We only have one village pacified in our territory. But if we settle down here, we're going to get two more. So... We definitely want to move in that direction. We shall see how this goes. Yeah, there we go. Build the altar next. Let's... Something. Battle. Um, we are under attack by a roaming army. But I think we'll be okay. Sure, let's go for it. Ready to fight. Okay, fair enough. Let's go. Kill! These are unfortunately flying units, not infantry units, so they're not gonna die as easily as the snakes did. Yeah, they're flying units, so they're gonna... Oh! Don't kill my hero! No killing my hero. Um... Dudes, I kind of want you to kill this guy instead. Like, everybody try to kill that guy. Because he's trying to kill my hero, I don't want this. No killing my hero, that's unfair. Um, I'm gonna let this be the battle plan. Uh, actually, no, you're gonna try to kill this guy. Not sure, which of you and move first? You two first, then the flying units. Uh, I think you're gonna be able to kill him. Let's try. Wait, what, what did you just... Oh no! That was a mistake, he actually has to go around. And this guy didn't take any damage at all. Oh dear. Oh, fine, keep this whole thing going. Flying ghosts. Oh, they're doing quite the number on me, but I, they are dying. I think we need to increase our army size a little bit to be safe. But still, they're gonna gain uh, experience, so it ain't all bad. Uh, we that was a glass deal deposit, right? Da -da 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 -da, there we go. Oh, the Mazari. Oh. 
Oh dear, um, that's not really the neighbor I wanted, to say the least. Um, nor is their location particularly nice for us. Um, So is this is actually a starting city? It must be. Uh, this is inland sea. Well, not ideal for us, by any means. Ah oh, well. We'll figure it out first. Though you're going to use you to explore whatever that is. Uh, more dust and pearls. Great. Now please return to the shore. And there should be a unit in the city here now. Yes, we have a settler. Um, new army, right. We need to create armies out of these guys. And then we need to walk. And we're walking, and we're walking, and we're taking huge risks. Nothing bad can possibly happen by sending out scouts unescorted, right? These now got more experience. Great. Okay, land here at least. Those villages are pacified. These are pacified. They sh so they shouldn't spawn armies. But there might already be one on the map. I know these guys... Oh, I like that one. I <laughs> like that one. Uh, oh dear. Um, try to stay close to this guy, Finn. I mean, I need to get them down here. Actually, let's have a look. Can I even see this unless I am in the right zone? Uh, I can't see every, all the resources down here, though. 11.617. No food at all. That's kind of bad. Um, but there's influence to be had up here with that square, so we kind of want to build in that direction. And we also kind of want to build down these, this area here so we get some food. Not an ideal spot. Um, I mean, this is just way freaking better. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I want to start see if we can get both of these two zones. That would be fantastic for us. Even better if that guy decides to expand uh, southward. And you were gonna go over here first. And pop that ruin. Fortune dust and some pearls. Oh, this region has some resources. Spices. this inland sea. Oh, so this continent might actually go further down this way. Uh, oh my. This is, this is a pretty big continent. A fairly big continent indeed. I will I'll keep doing what we're doing and see how that goes. So where are you, where are you gonna roam? the south. Okay. Fair enough. Oh. That was a mistake. There's only one here, right? Yeah, there's only one here. Um, gonna have to take some chances. I don't think he's gonna be able to attack this one. He has to go through the sky fin. 
population evolution. Yeah, that's fair enough. It says three. We have four populations since we pacified the village, though. I wonder. Switch one over. We're kind of low on growth. That's kind of what our civilization is about, unfortunately. But hey. Even build the centaurs. Uh, the problem is, of course, they don't really complement our civilization. Do I want to push for the museum? That's rather insane, but I might. Yeah, we'll see. We'll finish the altar first and see what the quest requires of us. Because we are going to get a new quest after that. As for this one, yeah, I think we'll explore in this direction. First. It said Inland Sea, and I'm kind of curious about that. Keep saying Inland Waters. This might just be all lakes, that means the continent is massive. And we shall find out, but that'll be another time. It is time for a short break, I think. Thank you for watching.